And, and one of the greatest jobs of, of marketing in the, in the universe has ever seen is Nike. Remember, Nike sells a commodity. They sell shoes. And yet, when you think of Nike, you feel something different than a shoe company. In their ads, as you know, they don't ever talk about the product. They, they honor great athletes, and they honor great athletics. That's who they are. That's what they are about. I've, uh, I've been back about uh, eight to 10 weeks, and uh, we've been working really hard. Uh, and what we're trying to do uh, is, is not something really highfalutin. We're, we're trying to get back to the basics. Uh, we're trying to get back to the basics of great products. Uh, and I think that, that Apple has, has pockets of greatness, but in some ways has drifted away from, from doing the basics. To me, marketing's about values. This is a very complicated world. It's a very noisy world. And we're not going to get a chance to get people to remember much about us. No company is. And so we have to be really clear on what we want them to know about us. Now, Apple, fortunately, is one of the half a dozen best brands in the whole world, right up there with Nike, Disney, Coke, Sony. It is one of the greats of the greats, not just in this country, but all around the globe. And, but, but, but even a great brand needs investment and caring if it's going to retain its relevance and vitality. And the Apple brand has clearly suffered from neglect in this area in the last few years. And we need to bring it back. The way to do that is not to talk about speeds and feeds. It's not to talk about MIPS and megahertz. It's not to talk about why we're better than Windows. The dairy industry tried for 20 years to convince you that milk was good for you. It's a lie, but they tried anyway. And <laughs> the sales were going like this. And then they tried got milk, and the sales have gone like this. And, and one of the greatest jobs of, of marketing in the, in the universe has ever seen is Nike. Remember, Nike sells a commodity. They sell shoes. And yet, when you think of Nike, you feel something different than a shoe company. In their ads, as you know, they don't ever talk about the products. They don't ever tell you about their air soles and why they're better than Reebok's air soles. What does Nike do in their advertising? They, they honor great athletes, and they honor great athletics. That's who they are. That's what they are about. Apple spends a fortune on advertising. You'd never know it. <laughs> You'd never know it. And um, we started working about eight weeks ago. And what we, the question we asked was, our customers want to know who is Apple and what is it that we stand for? Where do we fit in this world? And what we're about isn't making boxes for people to get their jobs done, although we do that well. We do that better than almost anybody in some cases. But Apple's about something more than that. Apple, at the core, its core value is that we believe that people with passion can change the world for the better. That's what we believe. And we've had the opportunity to work with people like that. And we believe that in this world. People can change it for the better. And that those people that are crazy enough to think they can change the world are the ones that actually do. And so what we're going to do in our first brand marketing campaign in several years is to, is to get back to that core value. A lot of things have changed. The market's a totally different place than it was a decade ago. And Apple's totally different. And Apple's place in it is totally different. We understand that. But values and core values, those things shouldn't change. The things that Apple believed in at its core are the same things that Apple really stands for today. And so we wanted to find a way to communicate this. And 
what we have is something that I am um, I am very moved by. It honors those people who have changed the world. Some of them are living, some of them are not. The theme of the campaign is is think different. Is the people honoring the people who think different and who move this world forward. And it's it is what we are about. It touches the soul of this company. This is who we are. This is what we stand for. How oh, do you like it? Yeah. Yeah. Good. I I know that some people will criticize us for you know, not talking about all those things about why we have better plug and play. But we've got to let people know who Apple is and why it's still relevant in this world.